Okay, good afternoon, uh, everyone that's watching. Uh, we follow up vid this uh, purge control valve solenoid for the EVAP. Basically, connect on the in inlet manifold and uh, that's a tank breathe. So, fuel tank. So, a couple of connectors on there. That end there it goes to the tank. That end there just goes onto the on the manifold there so you can blow through this as it's sitting static uh, not going to demonstrate it but this here is open so that's our vacuum leak that's what was causing our fuel chimes to be through the roof so what I've done just as we temporary just to prove it is uh, just blank her off there disconnected it so, go around and look at the fuel chimes and scan tool. That's is just in generic OBD. So nice. Let's see a little focus there. Fuel chimes, long terms down to 2.3. Short term terms hovering around the hovering around the zero. I'll take a wee bit while for it to relearn. But uh, not too bad. Uh, so, as we saw in the previous video, uh, the long term it was way up 20, 30 or something percent. Short term was up in around the 20s as well. So, that's a, another easy one, but you could spend a lot of time chasing the vacuum leak. Uh, you could smoke that manifold all you want and you ain't gonna see no smoke so uh, yeah again there's a couple of these I've done went straight to it when I seen that scan data uh, took it off blew, blew through it blocked her off and that proved it so uh, have one of them on order a uh, Bosch one there's a wee number on it there as well as a GM number, so I'll have one of them in order. Get that on. We car be running sweet, so it would have been overfueling it uh, at idle. Shane thing was it, was, it did have a P171, uh, but it was only in the pending uh, file, so uh, in the OBD. So uh, that's what led me to look at the, look at the field champs and. Uh, uh, wasn't permanent so probably because whenever you drive it obviously the fuel chimes will get better when you open the throttle plate uh, and open the manifold the uh, atmosphere it would uh, the fuel chimes will look okay so the engine computer thinks everything's all right so it doesn't it doesn't go into the permanent folder I, I assume that's what's going on but uh, I'm not 100% on that maybe somebody could chip in and uh, give a wee bit more technical information under why that happens uh, but that's what I reckon anyway uh, so proof of concept dead easy, very very common uh, as I say it's, it's a few of these I've seen and when I've seen those uh, very very high uh, fuel trims uh, in the positive uh, I went straight to that EVAP valve I didn't even bother uh, smoking it uh, it's a new a common failure. Hope this helps somebody. So there we go. 2013 course of date. Uh, get the sweet wee car run right for the wee yard. Thanks.